Hello! In this series of videos, we are going to knit together to make a setup bonnet on your Dina Beans sock machine. And I thought I would start by just reviewing the supplies you'll need. You will need project yarn for your setup bonnet and waste yarn in a sharply contrasting color as always, ideally about the same size as your project yarn. You'll need a ravel cord, which makes it a lot easier for casting on. A set of split rings, you'll need half as many as the number of needles on your cylinder. Standard supplies like your soft weight and cable ring. I use one and a half pounds. Uh, I use one weighted clip. You'll need a darning needle, scissors, three standard tools, your loom tool, pick tool, and latch tool. And then a piece of ribbon about 18 inches long. This is about a quarter of an inch thick. Maybe it's a half an inch thick. I think it's either way half an inch, I think. And then this is fray check, which helps um, secure the ends of the ribbon so they don't, they don't come apart on you later. Your first step from here is to cast on. If this is your very first project on your Dina Bean machine, you'll need to cast on without the setup on it. There's a video for how to do that at dinabean.com or on our YouTube page. If you do have a setup on it, then go ahead and cast on that way. Either way, after you cast on, you'll want to crank 10 or so rows of waist yarn. But this project, you want to have a kind of a loose tension because otherwise it's difficult to hang the split rings when we get to that step. So there's also a video on adjusting your tension at deanandbean.com. Let's get started. Visit us at deanandbean.com and please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.